better. <laughs> Former South Africa. What an honor. Nelson Mandela died in December, in but his Mandela legacy House. lives on. His family is continuing his human rights work. Mandela's granddaughters are here today. They're in the Southland to receive a special award. Princess Zaziwe Lamini Manawe and Princess Swati Lamini will receive the John Wayne True Grit Award from the John Wayne Cancer Institute. And they're here today with Dr. Anton Bilchik. Welcome, everyone. Thank, Thank you. you. So this is a, a great honor. And tell us what it means to your family and congratulations. Well, thank you, Sandra. It means a lot to our family for the John Wayne Institute to award the True Grit Award. Um, and for us to be able to be here to accept it on behalf of the family, um, you know, it was a great loss for us when my grandfather died in December. But I think the important thing is to continue his legacy and continue the work that he started. Um, and if we can do that in our own way, I think we would be making him very proud. So this is, I suppose, recognition of the fact that we are trying to continue his legacy. And um, we're truly, truly honored um, by the John Wayne Institute. And a lot of people don't know this, but there was a link uh, with your grandfather and John Wayne. Um, yes, there was. Um, my grandfather um, also suffered from prostate cancer, but uh, managed to beat the disease and live until 95, thankfully. And our cousin was diagnosed with breast cancer two years ago. So we've also had to face cancer and we've also had to endure a family member having to go through treatment. So we just think it's so important that we um, continue both John, like John Wayne's um, legacy and our grandfather's legacy to find a cure for this disease. And this weekend you will be recognized, a big gala event over at, in Beverly Hills at the Four Seasons. And doctor, you're going to be honored as well with the Duke Award. Tell us about that. Well, the Duke Award is just a, a recognition for cancer research and um, for the work that I've done as a surgeon, as a doctor, and as a cancer researcher, and I'm just thrilled to be part of this. And I know that you actually traveled to South Africa uh, recently and, and met with the Mandela family there. Yeah, this whole thing is completely surreal because um, <laughs> having, brought, you know, having grown up in South Africa and training and trained in South Africa and then uh, working in uh, Los Angeles and now for the John Wayne Cancer Institute, um, to be able to go to South Africa and this award, this True Grit Award, is this big, heavy award, mm. and to know that it's in the Mandela House and we shared this incredible um, day together in the Mandela House and Winnie um, came to visit as well. And when he, when he put it all together and spoke about how in South Africa, um, everyone got to watch the John Wayne movies. <laughs> and uh, she acknowledged the uh, John Wayne family um, and the similarities between the Mandela family and the John Wayne family in terms of everything that, you know, that they've done mm. to help with um, human rights and with cancer research. And uh, so it's just, it's my world all coming together. Uh, Swati, I know you grew up uh, with a, a relationship with your grandfather. Did he ever speak to you about the importance of carrying on his fight for human rights? Absolutely. I mean, my grandfather's biggest thing is education. Um, you know, he said that we can eradicate a lot of the world's problems through education. So it was something that was very important to him and um, even for us as his grandchildren and his children. Um, us finishing our education and going to school and seeing that through was something that's very important to him. Mm. So I think that, you know, there are many other lessons that he taught us, but this is the one that I would say is most important to me is that, you know, literacy is something that can alleviate a lot of the world's problems. Um, and by being able to sort of contribute and give back to society um, in, 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 in carrying his legacy forward yeah. is something that's very important to us. And what do you expect uh, to do with this big award, as the doctor says, when, when you take it back to South Africa? Um, awareness about cancer, um, early detection, um, speaking more about it, finding a cure, really. I mean, that's the most important thing here is to find a cure so that the next generation doesn't have to face the social injustice because cancer really, really is. And um, lots of people are faced with it every single day. So making it away and finding a cure is the most important thing I think we should do. And doctor, we are making incredible progress and some of that work is being done at the John Wayne Cancer Institute. Yeah, the, the, the John Wayne um, Cancer Institute has really pioneered many new techniques for cancer. We recently lost one of our founders, Dr. Donald Morton, who was the inventor of the sentinel node technique mm -hmm. for melanoma that has transformed the way um, skin cancer is managed in the world today. And that technique was then translated to breast cancer so that women don't need to get unnecessary lymph node dissections. So everything in the John Wayne is geared towards innovation and developing new treatments to really personalize cancer care. That's really the buzzword now. Mm -hmm. So that not 
so people aren't all treated the same, and we can um, treat those that need, that need chemotherapy, for example, and really avoid treatment in those that are likely cured by surgery alone. Well, so honored to have all three of you here. Thank you all for your good work. Doctor, congratulations. Princesses, congratulations. And the big event coming up uh, this Saturday night, right? Yes. In Beverly Hills. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank, Thank you, you all for being here. All right. It is called the Odyssey Ball in Beverly Hills, where the doctor and the princesses will be honored this weekend. For more information about it, just go to kcal9.com. You can click Seen on TV.